But we are packing and things are kind of crazy today at our house because we're leaving on a vacation for spring break. So we are actually going to Kauai! Woo! So we went to Oahu last year and now we want to try going to Kauai. So we have all our gear out, we're packing. David actually just booked our luau because <laughs> kind of forgot to do that and we wanted to do a luau. So some of the activities that we have planned are surfing lessons. We're gonna do that a couple times. Zip lining, we're going tubing down a canal, lots of hiking and playing at the beach. Um, what else? I think that's all, we tried to not overbook ourselves i had to double check we tried to not overbook ourselves this time because last time when we went to oahu we packed it in we did everything touristy and we didn't want to miss a single thing so this time we're actually just going to take it a little bit more chill hopefully play on the beach and go hiking a lot hopefully this is gonna be awesome we're gonna film a lot of cool awesome videos we're super stoked or excited or Something. Something. So but tell gonna, them what happened today. What call did yeah, you get? Yeah, so I just barely got a call from our rental house. They're like, oh, by the way, uh, yeah, the washer and dryer don't work and there's no hot water and it's not going to be ready for you when you get there tomorrow. Like what? what? We booked this like two like, months ago. We're just going Three months on the ago. airplane tomorrow morning. Yeah, so they're like, like, oh, here's another house. Case scenario. They gave us another house that we could go to. It was different. I don't know if we really like it. It wouldn't be as good for filming. And so we're just going to stay there with no hot water. They um, said that one bathroom will have hot water, but the others will not. And so. hopefully, I kind of hope we have laundry services. Yeah, I think, I think they're supposed to have somebody in there tomorrow before we get there to fix that. So, yeah, so hopefully we have a place. If not, maybe we'll sleep on the beach. We'll go glamping. Oh, yeah. So, this the house that we have scheduled actually has a really nice beach. And you walk out from your house onto the beach. And that's what we did in Oahu. And the kids were like, that was so fun. I want to be able to just wake up in the morning and go play on the beach. So we tried to find a place on Kauai that did that. And there honestly was not a whole lot of choices. We knew we wanted it on the east. We didn't want to be down where it's busy. We wanted to kind of have a private type beach. And so we were being a little bit pickier about it. Anyway, this house has a great beach great house it's beautiful it has all the beds that we need and then this other house that they're offering it looks like it has a tiny beach but it's overgrown with shrubs and the bedrooms are kind of weird in it because it has like three different it's like huts, huts. <laughs> yeah it's like huts i don't know how else to explain it so we could all cram into one hut or we could do some separate huts but i don't think the kids would stay in the hut by themselves i don't know if i want them to on a place that we're not familiar with. Um, it could be kind of fun though you, that you would dare someone to stay the night in one in the dark. I don't know. If we get end up there, if we end up there, it's okay. We'll make do, it'll be all right because this is gonna be an awesome vacation. Guys, I gotta show you what we pack when we go to Hawaii because I kind of figured it out a little bit last year. So here's all our stuff. I'm starting to lay out clothes. I have like their swimsuits. I'm going to bring two swimsuits with rash guards because when we go tubing and um, playing in the water a lot, that will be nice to have um, as well as with surfing. Then I'm getting some keen shoes. It's new this year for everybody because we're going hiking and on Kauai, I hear it's really muddy. It rains a lot where we're planning on hiking. So they recommended to get keen shoes, which I did so that hopefully our feet, our shoes don't get suctioned down into the mud. And then we're bringing our snorkeling gear that we got last year. Us germaphobes don't want to rent and share. Plus it gives us the ability to snorkel whenever we please. Then I'm grabbing bug spray and um, suntan lotion, sunblock. Uh, the bug spray, we never used in Oahu, but here they say they need to. Last year, our rental house had tons of sunblock and bug spray on the shelf that everybody had left there. So I'm kind of wondering if that's what's going to happen again this time. I don't know. I'm bringing it anyway. I mean, I'm sure you can buy it there in Hawaii, but I'm bringing it. And then we're going to be bringing some glue. <laughs> because we're gonna have Jordan make some slime in some fun places. So it should be pretty exciting. I'm ready to do some super cool adventures um, and see what places we can explore. 
Okay guys, so I was packing the boys clothes making sure they were ready to go to Hawaii tomorrow and I kind of forgot that Jake had a huge growth spurt this year. Yay. So <laughs> none of his summer clothes fit him nor his summer shoes. So um, we have to actually go buy him new shorts to take to Hawaii because he doesn't have any that fit. And then we have to find him new swim shoes. First of all, because they wouldn't fit, but also because he lost one in the ocean last yeah. time we were there. <laughs> So he has none and I think we want to have swim shoes since there's like volcanic rock and coral reefs and whatever. We just don't want his feet to get hurt. So we're off to the store to buy stuff for Jake and since we're going into town, why not go to dinner? So we got everybody here woo, headed woo. off to dinner. I think that we're going to go to a steakhouse and grab what? some yes. yummy steak. I hope I have the gift cards. Uh -oh. <laughs> I'll double check. Anyway, that's what we're doing. It's last minute craziness trying to pack. You never know what's gonna happen. We're gonna be up all night. Woo! Woo! Hope I like packing. Oh, yay! Jordan's trying to find some stuff for hiking in Hawaii. And <laughs> I found some rain jackets that are nice, Got like lightweight stuff. ones that are good for the boys so that when it rains on them, they won't get cold. Yeah, because it rains a lot in Hawaii. So we are, so Jordan and I already have rain jackets. Yeah. But the boys we're needed them. We're expecting the rain. We actually already had one. You have a light, a rain jacket that's lightweight like I this? Have, I had a green one. You have a green one? Where? Where is it? Do you have a green one? Look at this! Guys, it is hailing huge balls of hail right now as we're driving to the airport. Look, I caught some. Look how big! Those are ginormous! It's crazy, guys! <laughs> so traffic's a little crazy going through the canyon. We're going 25 miles an hour. So we are ready to... We're actually in the vehicle hiding, heading to the airport. So we got up pretty early this morning because <laughs> we had some last minute items to pack. Jordan had to film a video I need to get some video um, stuff ready for this morning, for today, no, no. and David had to get some videos sent off to editors, so we were up pretty early getting things done this morning before we had to leave, finishing last. Then we took Logan to Grandpa's, now we're headed to the airport, and this is crazy. I have my seatbelt on, don't worry. <laughs> yes. So crazy. I hope we make it too. There was a semi truck in the canyon that was like having a really hard time because there's black ice on the road and they were not getting traction. So they were having a really, really hard time going up in the canyon. You wanna um, know like something amazing though? What? I was just like taking a nap because I was really tired and I woke up trying to find these seasick band thingies. That way I don't get car sick because I get car sick really uh -oh. easy. Look guys. Oh. It spun out. Oh, I don't know. There is a car, a truck that just hit that middle cement thing. Oh, that's so scary. It's so scary, guys. This is like so dangerous. It's slippery. This canyon. It's complete ice underneath. Yeah. This. So people are sliding. There's cops in the canyon, so that's good. Um, but it is. It's crazy. So Jordan found what? I found gummy worms, and Ooh. I'm really happy because these are like my favorite things ever. Half one. That's awesome. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're just gonna drive safe. We're so glad that we're getting out of this crazy snowy yeah. weather, headed to Hawaii, Woo! where it's so nice. Or at least we hope it is. This past week, the weather was crazy. It looked like it was starting to get warmer, like it was becoming spring again. But then it started snowing like this, so I'm really glad we're leaving. <laughs> and we're at spring break, so. I don't think it's spring. Yeah, it's not even spring. <laughs> yeah, this is not a very great spring, but this is not abnormal for where we live. This is kind of normal -ish. It's like a fake spring. So, it was trying to yeah. trick us. The flowers start blooming in our front yard and then snow. That's <laughs> kind of normal. <laughs> but I'm so glad because tonight I can stick my feet in the ocean. Woo! Oh yeah, I'm going to the ocean as soon as we land. I'm going outside. She's not. Well, We're getting in at nine o'clock at night, oh, which will be one o'clock our okay. time, and we have to get groceries and drive at probably an hour to wow. our rental. Okay, then I won't go swimming, but I'm gonna at least go outside. Go I'm out like, to the beach and explore it yeah. at like midnight, right? 
I want to see what it looks like. Oh, 3 a.m. at the beach. Yeah, do you guys want to sleep on the beach tonight? No. <laughs> what? Come on. Okay guys, we made it to the terminal. We actually made it through security pretty fast. The only hold up was that David and I forgot to take out our battery packs, which are fairly large, large, so they kind of get stopped by security, as well as David's Kindle, which we forgot was in his backpack. So that was the only hold up. We raced off to our terminal. But I had a battery pack. We made pack it, but Jig made it through with the battery pack. I don't know. Anyway, we made it through. We're ready to go to Hawaii, but we haven't had lunch, so David and Jordan ran off to get us some burgers. So we're gonna board the plane, me and the boys, and then hopefully they'll get some food for us and board shortly. Hello. <laughs> Jordan made it back. She got food. What? You want food? I got food. I, ma I managed, to, uh, managed to magically get drinks. Well, I think David brought them. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yum. Now we can eat on the plane. And I think they're getting ready to board. We barely made it. Good job. I'm so hungry. We made it on. Oh, yeah. Delta I and Jordan are sitting by me. Captain George. We made it to California for our next layover and we were, thought we'd have to rush, but look, we're sitting here. We didn't have to rush. This is great. Ah, that was a quick short flight. Just one more and we're in Hawaii. Can't wait. Okay guys, we made it to Hawaii. We're actually getting our rental van now. It's pretty late at night and we have a little bit of a drive. And there's a chicken walking in the road. Wait, I where? love it. Right there. It's an actual chicken. There's a little chicken. I love that. There's so many chickens in Hawaii. That's cool. It's just roaming the parking lot. But anyway, David's in getting our rental vehicle and then we're taking off to our house. Why did the house. chicken cross the road? Why? I don't know. It's doing it right now. It is doing it. It's crossing the road. It's crazy. So Jordan's feet are hurting because that was they a don't long hurt flight. Anymore, though. It was really weird. It's just from sitting because she sits so long that yeah. and she didn't get up and move at all. Because no. she was stuck in the middle seat and like so the no place to rest again. And so then I was like stuck. I was yeah, like, yeah, she the entire didn't flight. have a really good seat, but it was fine though. Anyway, we're here. she's yeah, we're here. That's all that matters. We're here, guys. Yay! Here's our little chicken friend. He came to say hi. Hi, chicken, chicken. Um, oh, is he gonna make the gap? Is this chicken gonna take the gap? Let's see, are you really going to make that? Whoa! Good job, little chicken. What are you going after? He's just very confused. I think he's just like chill here. He's like, I just hear. <laughs> he looks at you like you are weird. <laughs> there are so many chickens. I forgot like how many chickens there are just yeah. like hang chilling on. in Hawaii. Yeah. It's just There's so many. Here, you know? They're so cool though. <laughs> <laughs> we made it to our beach house in Hawaii where we're staying at. And if you listen really closely, you can hear the ocean right out there. I'm so excited. I can hear the waves. We're really close to the ocean. So if you guys want to see a house tour, um, You'll have to go check that out on Jordan Mae Williams. And you can see a house tour of our beach house where we're staying at in Kauai. That's it for today. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.